Hello! Does this look like music to you? Well, it actually is, and I'm gonna show you what it sounds like in a minute. So there's this program called Sonic Pi, and you can use this application to actually script music and feel like a nerd for some time. I think in the end you could say that it works like a sampler and step sequencer. By the way, how do you like my mic setup? And I'm gonna answer the one and only question, does it gent? But first let me show you how this thing works. So I learned about the basics using the tutorial on the website, but from there it's just gonna be trial and error. I am going to set up sound, a uh, synthesizer with a saw wave, and I want to have it played using this note, and let's see what happens. Boing. Awesome. And now I can tell it how often it should play. Four times. Do. And between the notes it should sleep for the value of one, which is not uh, one bar, it's actually a quarter note, and now it sounds like this. But you don't only get to use the internal synths it comes with, you can also use samples. And there are some samples already built in, but you can also add your custom samples. Most of the internal sounds are made for electronic music. Cowbell. So I'm gonna try to find the sample folder and add my own sounds. Okay, no, no, there it is. This is where the magic happens. So I prepared some sounds for this. Bass drum, simps, snare drum. And because I'm super lazy, I just put the guitar and bass sound in one file. Okay, just gonna drag them into the folder. And now the program should be able to find my custom sounds. Snare drum gent, right above snare drum dolph. Okay, now I gotta know what this dolph sample sounds like. That's not what I expected, but I'm gonna fix that. Replace this file, please. Okay, so now the sample snare drum doll sounds like this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what it should sound like. Let's see if the program is fine with all our other custom sounds. I'm going to add this pauses so it doesn't play them all at once. All right, so we're good to go. Let's see, I'm gonna go with the bass drum first. <clears throat> Let's try to make some pattern. Da -ga -da -ga -da -da. Oh, well that didn't work. I probably have to tell it to play that sample for every step. Yeah, we figured it out. I can already tell that this is gonna look very messy in the end. Da -da 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 uh, I really hope my neighbors can hear me right now going da 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 da. Pretty sure that there's a more elegant way to do this so that I don't have to insert this operator over and over again. Okay, now I have my pattern and I want it to repeat it like four times. Make it a Q, so do, and. And now it should play all of this four times. Now we have to do this with all the other samples. And I really wonder if we can make multiple cues but have them play at the same time. But for now let's go with the stupid and probably unnecessarily complicated way. Just insert the other samples in between those things. Here goes a snare drum. Da, 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 da. Crash on the one, two, three, four. Yeah, that's it. But I'm really losing track here. Let's put some notes in here. One, two, three, four. Oh, this is looking awful. So all of this is just one bar, which repeats four times. Time to add guitar and bass to see if this thing really gents. But Sonic Pi is not gonna cut the sample before it plays again. So I have to tell it to shorten it using a release. Maybe set it to 0.1. I think one of these need to go there. That's still quite long. Does this thing actually work? No, it doesn't. <sighs> Let's try sustain. That worked. Okay, not quite. Yep. Gonna copy these operators to the shorter notes. The. The. Here and there. And when it says 0 0.5, I need it to play a little longer. 0 0.5. Copy paste the hell out of it. And that should be it. So creepy that all of this is just one bar. Ooh, I have an idea. I want to know if we can actually pitch the sample of the guitar and the bass. Oh, yeah, there's a pitch command. Oh no. 
We have an error. Ah, oh, it says it right here. Pitch must be a value less than or equal to 24. And I got 60. Pitch it up here and here. Now it should go da 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 da. <laughs> and that's it. Let's see what it sounds like. This sound was unexpected. Huh? That's weird. Okay, this doesn't work very well. Okay, I changed some more steps, and this is how a metal breakdown sounds like in Sonic Pi. Yeah, I don't like it either. It's actually fun to play around with this. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe, and see you next time.